Hey guys, Metal Viking 82 here, back with just a small CD collection update. Uh, if I screw up or you know mispronounce anything, I've been up since three o'clock this morning. I started a new shift at work, and the first day is always a killer. So I'm a little tired, and I've tried making this damn video. I don't know how many times now. But, um, yeah, I just got a small stack of CDs to show off this time. I got uh, several things coming in the mail, stuff that I pre-ordered within the last couple months, and they should hopefully be arriving within the next week or so, so I'm really looking forward to that stuff. Though, I think uh, one is not going to be here until probably September, but I digress. Uh, the first thing I got is this uh, single that I found for like two bucks, and it came with a coupon for two dollars off the new album. Got the new ghost single really cool love the songs on here I cannot wait for this new album got the new Fear Factory Genexus yeah, it's not too bad I mean it's not their best work by any means but still pretty cool and I like the packaging of this it's very glossy and reflects light quite a bit Got the new While She Sleeps, Brainwashed. I actually forgot this was even coming out. I haven't heard a whole lot about this band in a long ass time, so good to see they got a new album out finally. Got the new Lamb of God, Sturm und Drang. Got this for eight bucks at FYE. You can't pass up a deal like that. Uh, I honestly have not heard any of the new material, so I'm uh, really looking forward to giving this a spin, especially since I heard uh, Randy Blythe uses some clean vocals on this. So. That should be interesting. Got the new Cataclysm album of Ghosts and Gods. Real happy to find this at Best Buy. Um, FYE for some reason didn't have it, and a lot of times they do have, you know, new stuff by Nuclear Blast, but uh, they didn't have new Cat. Oh, yeah. There you go. See, tired, screwing up already. But uh, yeah, they didn't have the new Cataclysm, but Best Buy had it, and I was really happy about that. And. Uh, found out about this band just kind of randomly. I think I saw an ad for it in the magazine and I checked it out. It's a really cool sounding uh, old school death metal. Got uh, Undead with False Prophecies and I uh, really dig that cover. It's uh, pretty damn creepy I have to say. But uh, yeah, not much is really known about this band at least as far as I know. Nobody really knows who's in this band from what I've been able to read but uh, yeah, pretty killer stuff I have to say. And then I got Were Goat, Unholy Exaltation of Full Moon Perversity. My last vinyl update, you saw I bought the vinyl of this. I also got the CD, it was only six bucks, so couldn't pass it up. And the last one that I got, Mayhem's Ordo Ad Keo. Haven't really heard much from this, though. A lot of people were kind of eh, iffy about it, but still, yeah, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm a completist to an extent. There are some bands that no matter what, I will not complete their collection because it's all total crap. But, you know, when it comes to Mayhem, I pretty much try to buy everything. So, yeah, that is my update. Thanks a lot for watching and subscribing. And sorry about all the screw-ups, but I was not going to stop this video and try it again. So, until next time, stay brutal.